Ladies and gentlemen, good God, it's good to be back here. <laughs> I know I just recorded yesterday, but man, I can't explain how I need this in my life. Ladies and gentlemen, today is a very important day. December 13th, 2016 marks one of my greatest achievements, both in the sense of like what I've done and achievement as in uh, this wise. Ladies and gentlemen, I freaking did it. I got platinum in all events in prototype. I did all the consumes yesterday. I, I got everything gold yesterday and I woke up this morning. Actually, I worked on platinum yesterday a little bit. Turns out like whenever you get like a good enough score in gold, it'll transfer the platinum. It, it'll say you've got platinum. Like it, it'll count it as platinum because you have obviously done that score. You've done good enough to get platinum when you were going for gold. You know what I mean? And like half of them, ladies and gentlemen, I didn't even have to do. Like I had like all but two glides were done. I had like two movements that I had gotten, and you know th those were apparently were the hardest ones. And uh, a lot of my kills were already platinum, and a lot of my uh, my wars were already platinum. And uh, so I just had to go through and just just finish like clean up. It was of course of course it was the harder ones that weren't platinum, but uh, dude, I, I did it. I was. Um I did cheat a little bit on, uh, I think, two of them. Some of the hard... I think uh, there was one called Demolition that was really hard. You had to get, like, 200 kills in, like, two minutes, and it was... You're, you're in the Thermal Barrack tank, but it's still really hard. What I did, I just uh, hijacked a bunch of tanks and then set them all together then like, shot one time, and it gave me, like, 100 points in, like, in, a, in a second. So I did kind of cheat them, but at the same time, you got to understand, it's platinum events are ridiculous but you got also you got to say i did all the movements and all the glides and some of those glides uh the one i had the most trouble with was uh wrong side of the tracks where you had to go under the bridge halfway and like if you'd hit anything besides where you were gonna land like it would count as like that's where you landed so it, it was uh, it's kind of rough but dude i did it i freaking did it and I, that was like one of the biggest hardest achievements of my life, uh, it's probably it probably goes Mile High Club, this one, and let's see, let's pick another one that was kind of hard. Uh, Bridge over Trebled Slaughter, might be one of the or no, the realism achievement from Left 4 Dead 2. But you know, now all that's left is the easy stuff. Got to go around and get all the landmarks. But I already have like 45 of 50 hints and like 150 out of 200 uh, landmark collectibles. So just got to find a guide, then just go with it, man, and just just do it. Just do it. That's all I got to do is do it. So I. I am on cloud nine right now, ladies and gentlemen, rocking and rolling. I've also been working on, uh, I know you guys came here to see Grand Theft Auto, but I've also been working on some Forza Horizon stuff, too. Uh, you guys need to buy my uh, thing. I made a vinyl. You cats need to buy it. It's called SRF Games. It's a thousand, it's a thousand credits. It's under logos. It's a vinyl. It's under logos and uh, video games. Or, or just just uh, type in my gamer tag. It's in the about page, Godfather XLZ3. So, ladies and gentlemen, I did the thing yesterday with Michael. The the wear the rose for 10 consecutive days. I done dang doll did that. And uh, it turns out you can just save your game like 40 times in a row, and that counts as that. So we're definitely going to be doing that stuff today. We're going to do the side quest. As far as I can see, ladies and gentlemen, we only have one side quest for Trevor and one side quest for Michael, the Epsilon, and then Josh. He came up yesterday, ladies and gentlemen, like he just popped up on the screen. He gave me a so let's see what he's got Sir, to say. We're going to need a little more to go on than that. Uh-oh. Tony! Where's your wife? Yeah. Naomi. Officers, here he is. This man what? is insane. He just what? destroyed my house. Whoa, hey. No, wait a minute. You asked me. He's he's ruined what? my life. He's he's a, he's a stalker. He's he's an epsilonist. Yeah. What? What? Get him. what? No, it's not fair. That's the opposite of fair. Freeze. Oh my god. Ah. Hands in the my car. Air. No, this is my car now. Take it's gonna down. be easy to lose oh, the cop when you take their car. So. <laughs> oh god. Right, right turn, right turn. There we go. Boo, y'all. Dude, ladies, why would Josh just turn on us like that? That is not fair. Like that was our home dog. He gave us bouncy bouncy for insurance fraudy fraudy. <laughs> and now yes. he's two timing us. Weasley. Fuck. That's you can't hide from Trevor Phillips, I'll dude, find you. Dude, you can't trust anybody, Trevor, dude. Trevor is gonna find Josh and he's gonna go at him with a blowtorch and a pair of pliers, like Marcellus Wallace did to that hillbilly freaking Oh god. Okay, which way to go? Which way should I go? Oh my god. Either way, either way, either way, I'm screwed. 
So, ladies, it's been a very interesting day as far as video gaming goes in my life. And, uh, dude, I... You see, Prototype is one of those games where I thought, oh, I'm never going to do it. Like, it's it's just never going to be 100%. It's going to be that one game, you know. Everybody has that one game that they're just never going to 100%. And I have, like, a hundred of those games. And I thought definitely Prototype was going to be that game. Dude, why didn't I shoot him? Should have shot Josh. Oh, why didn't I shoot him? I'm an idiot. He had that coming. Why didn't I shoot Josh? Well, because he didn't shoot me. Sex over murder, I guess. Okay, so I guess he'll call that. Yes, he'll call back. So let's go ahead and go be Michael and finish off these Epsilon missions. I think there's a couple more, actually. But wearing the robes for 10 days was, the, you know, the, the biggest deal. So, uh, Yeah, what have you been doing, ladies? You've been rocking and rolling. Dude, I, I spent my money on a car. I hope it lets me. Yes! This is my car. This is the Salmonator car. Dang right, dude. Oh, my gosh. It's like upgraded all the way. It doesn't have good armor, but uh, everything... Everything inside the car is fantastic, but th part of me like really, really doesn't want to drive all this way. But you know, we got a new car. I might as well, right? Just hang out and have a good time. So, tell me a story, ladies. Put in the comments what in the like who if you've gotten the, the platinum achievement and if we can share in that together. Just the enjoyment of having that, because that that is that. I mean, that dude. I'm. I, if I'd been recording uh, an hour ago, dude, there'd be some swearing going down. Mother, uh, God, mother, uh, yeah, it was, it was bad. I was pretty upset. I got upset at one, like I was like one point away from getting it, and it was like one of the harder ones. I'm like, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me, mother? Like I was very angry. I'm so glad there was nowhere, nobody was home, or else it may have been a problem. But anyway, dude, it was. Uh, I'm glad we got it. Now, that's just one less thing I gotta worry about in my life. Oh my god, it's the platinum achievement. I'm curious, just, you know how Xbox One has done like the updated kind of achievement thing where like you get rare achievements and you get like a diamond, you know what I mean? I'm curious to see what percentage of gamers have gotten platinum on that because like a lot of people have had a lot of trouble on it. You know, it's like next to the Mile High Club and stuff like that, I, as far as I'm concerned. I don't know what the hardest achievement, like, ever is, you know. I say the Mile High Club because it's really legendary for being extremely difficult. But as far as my personal hardest achievement goes, I'd have to, I'd have to flip through my games. Like, you know, we just don't have that much time. Um, so, I'll think about it. If I think, oh, God. I'll think about it, and if I, if I remember, I'll, I'll tell you. But I probably will because I'm thinking about the game right now. Dude, this game is all but over. You have no idea. Like, we are going to start the, uh, not, not start heights, we're going to start setting up for the UD, ladies and gentlemen, in, in these uh, set of episodes. The four episodes that are to be recorded today, the UD will be scoped out and whatnot. Because right after the Ethelon chapter, bro, we're just going to jump right into it, unless something else pops up. But I haven't seen anything for Frank or anybody. So love this car. Like, I tried to find a Lamborghini to upgrade, but I just couldn't. <laughs> I ended up running into this one. I forget where I found it. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh. And, uh, but I love it, dude. It's just, it's, 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 man. It goes. Of course, I just, okay, I was about to say, don't, don't tell me I passed it. It was his uncle that built the damn house. I mean, what have you been doing, ladies and gentlemen? Dude, I've been watching, I've actually been watching YouTube videos, believe it or not. Like, I normally watch, like, a top 10 video at night or two or three top 10 videos or actually I'm hung up on the most satisfying videos you know those really weird videos that are strangely enough satisfying I, I've been watching those like crazy I love those I like the, the hour long ones where I can just sit and watch yeah, dude, I don't know why I love those so much but I do but um I've been watching NCS and Super Mario Galaxy 2 because I'm trying to brush up on it Oh, what is this? What in the world did you bring me, dude? I'm gonna lose this car. Ah, oh, brother Zondar, I Hello. knew you'd come. These are the robes, by the way. I was told to come. Chris needs you to take this plane to initiate Boston. What it awaits you in the east? Okay, detailed as ever. Truth must be revealed gradually until you're capable of understanding it. The east is practically the west if you're talking in circles. You know what I'm saying? Oh, I'm gonna hate to say goodbye to this car. Oh, there's only one true way to say goodbye to something so beautiful, and that's to blow it up as you thought. What? Hey, how did that? What was that? How was that?
Was that a thing? I didn't know that was a thing. Dang it, man. I wasn't going to blow the plane up. Now I can't say goodbye to my car. Dang it. I was told to come. Chris yeah. needs you to take this plane Kim to initiate Boston. Boston. Coffee. I figured out what the problem you was. In the east. Okay. Detailed oh, as so ever. Truth um. must be revealed gradually until you're capable of understanding it. Really? Anyway, what well, the problem was, I have this filter in the top. Like, it filters out the water. Not like the coffee filter, but like there's a filter on top of the, the coffee filter that filters the water that gets poured in. And, turns out, it's been a long time since we replaced that. In fact, we've never replaced it. And all that sediment, all that, uh, those minerals and all the different kind of chemicals and stuff that were in the water that were filtered out, they have gathered on top of that filter. And then whenever we put the filter back in to make new coffee, you know, like, you just get that horrid, irony, mineral taste, which is what I was tasting. So, I probably have a super dose of iron and bad stuff in my body. My eternal right brother, now. brother, you get the secret plane from the secret location? Uh, yeah, secret. I'm in the top <laughs> secret baby blue plane. Where am I heading? <laughs> it's Unknow it, and you'll know. Look, it can you just know. know it for me so we can move this thing along? Please. Okay, but that's entry-level stuff, bro. Intrigue. Sandy Shores Airfield. I'll meet you there. Kiflom. Kiflom. I guess, dude. Why Why do we keep fly planes? Why do I have to give up my favorite car in the universe just to fly a giant baby blue plane? It's just like Vice City all over again with the skimmer. Anyway. Actually, we were spreading pornography in the city, so that that is definitely worth it. Uh, What have you been doing? Please put in the comments what in the world you've been doing. Cause I missed you guys. Like, like, I haven't... I don't have... A lot of people, ladies and gentlemen, and like it's all all joking aside, it, it's kind of lonely on the planet Sam, and uh, that it's my fault. Like it's nobody else's fault. It's my fault. Like I'll, I'll take the blame for it. But uh, how have you cats been? Like I, I I like to think we have a very special relationship. Me and my uh, 92 subscribers, the 92 coolest cats on the block. I think we have a very special relationship, and I would like to commune with you guys. Dude, maybe we could, like, gather somewhere. Like, wh where's the nearest YouTube convention? And we would just meet each other. Or if you cats are in the uh, Atlanta, Georgia-ish Chattanooga area, we can just, like, meet up at O'Charlie's or something. I don't know. I'm down with that. Leave the plane and go to Jimmy. Jimster! The Jimnado! Isn't this Trevor's airfield? Does he know we're using his stuff? I hope so. I don't want to get shot in the face. Yo, get Jimmy flying, Jim. bro. Keep flying. Got the money? Keep flying. Cool. And the plane? <laughs> Keep flying. Oh, nice. <laughs> You're almost a thesis of truth, bro. You nearly there? It's gonna cost a little time and effort, and then it's astro planes and 37,000 places all at once. Ooh. I can't wait. And the chicks. Oh! Oh! <laughs> girls, girls, girls. You know, Chris and I sometimes watch porn together in the nude. Uh. Just to prove we don't get turned on by it. It's pretty awesome. Really? Is it? Anyway. Kiflon, man. Later. Is it? I, I would fail that oh. test immediately. Chris says, if you're ready, here's a tree of truth. Now, he'll arrange a map, but it's kind of expensive to reach this level of existence. Excuse me? You'll need quite a bit of money. Someone will mail you, bro. Mind if I take the plane? What? Kiflon. <laughs> Kiflon. Yeah, whatever. Anyway. I don't know if you guys remember in Vice City, there was that commercial about my Batsu Thunder and all that that car. You know what I'm talking about? My, the my Batsu car. There's actually one in this game, ladies and gentlemen. I found it like right when I was like driving to Josh to start the video. There was a my Batsu like right by the strip club, and I got in. And I'm like, oh, I've never seen this car before. And I looked at the name. And I was like, oh my god. Anyway, it was interesting to say the least, ladies and gentlemen. How much money? I. Like, I'm curious, like, it cost me $25,000 for these ropes. I don't have a lot of money since I spent it on the car, but, uh, I guess, oh my god, I just spit all over my computer. I am so sorry. Like, I'm normally not a, a, a ugly person. I'm trying to be nice. Okay, we, we are not driving back. I'm sorry. I refuse to drive. Do you ready to set up the heist? I got in the video. Thanks for watching. I'm keep keeping you. We're gonna set Hi. up the heist in the next Can episode. Can I get a cab? Absolutely. Kiflon. Drive is on the way. Great. Kiflon. So, when in doubt, ladies and gentlemen, Kiflon's out. You know what I'm saying? 
So, I like that car. It's like a Volkswagen. Tanner has a Volkswagen. Old one like that. He calls it his baby. Like, cause he tricks it. He, like, he's a car guy. I wish I had the knowledge of cars that he has. It's amazing. Like, if I was born back in the 60s, it would have it would have been cars, guitars, and chicks. And... It was, there was no cars, unfortunately, so it was just guitars and chicks. So And there's no girls now, so it's just guitars. <laughs> that's, that's just the way it is. All joking aside, there's a lot of truth in the things I say, that's even though right, that I'm man. trying to make you laugh. I'm trying to use my harsh truths to entertain people, which is the same thing comedians do, so I guess my life's one big freaking joke. What's up, mate? My... Oh, my God. That did not work. To... I'm going to kill you. No, 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 no death, no death. Thanks for watching this. We're going to do this. Wait, where's the thing? Oh, it's in. The, oh, 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 my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Oh, we are going to hang out here. For twins, 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 twins. We are just going to hang out here forever. A kiff long. Dang right. Okay. Ladies, thank you for watching. Keep it real. You cats, kids on the flip side. We're going to go start up the heist. Keep it real. And peace.